if you think about all the information that is being stored on a day-to-day -day basis, the current state of electronics is reaching a limitation. My name is Ruin Farshi. I come from the United States. I am 29 years old. I am a material scientist and I work in the Paul Drude Institute for Festkörper Electronic in Berlin. I was born and raised in the United States. During my teenage years, I was in Tehran. It gives me, I think, an extra dimension, a different perspective in life. Yeah, I think that does help also in research. To be able to see things from different points of view. I research a relatively new field. It's known as spintronics. Germany has been quite competitive, always at the cutting edge of the field. The goal is to use the spin of electrons in addition to their charge to make the information processing much more powerful. This would completely move away from this kind of electronic capacitor technology that relies on these uh, rare materials like tantalum, for example. This element, tantalum, is used in electronic capacitors. My work is to develop new materials that would allow to control the electron spin. The main theme is to bring together ferromagnets that we know, iron, nickel, cobalt, with semiconductors that are used. It's challenging. They don't like to be together. I live in Berlin. The energy of the city is is really quite high, sort of electricity in the air. Serendipity and surprise is really the spice of the researcher's life because if everything goes according to plan, it would be quite boring. <laughs> the scientific work must be very precise, rigorous, whereas in music, one can be much more loose, open, spontaneous. I think it's important to be able to take a break and come back again and see things fresh.